ba doop ba doop boop boop boo The personal is political. That was a rallying cry for a lot of feminists in the 1970s and 1960s. The exact origin of the phrase is unknown and often debated, and many second wave feminists use that phrase and its underlying message in their writing, speeches, consciousness raising, and other activities. Okay, discuss. What does it actually mean? It means, at least to me, that we should be looking at the political issues all across the spectrum of issues themselves. It's really the basis of human security as a development priority. Looking at things that affect the individual, maybe even on a personal level, as something significant before you make politicized and generally political decisions. That may not be the easiest way to really explain it, so let me give you an example. Say you're a young graduate. You sunk money into education and now you're trying to enter the job market and there just aren't enough. That responsibility of providing jobs, of looking after the economy, while many believe that that's a personal issue and whatever you choose and look for in a job is completely your own business, it's still to some extent the responsibility of decision makers and policy makers, even governments to make sure that there are enough jobs to go around. Especially if they promise that in their politicking and campaigning in the lead up to their eventual place in a decision making space. It's about holding people accountable to what they've promised individuals, communities, and the citizenry at large. It's the same with healthcare, with the recognition of the LGBTIQ community in law and legislation and constitutions. The same for rural communities, especially rural women. You could politicize nearly every aspect of public and private life. You shouldn't just be labeled as a citizen and left to your own devices because no man is an island and we all exist, especially as citizenry, within a community communities that have elected leaders. So that rallying cry, the personal is political, is about that in essence. The fact that we want to hold people accountable because they make decisions that affect our personal lives, our private lives. It isn't just about what is seen or what is the true responsibility of a government or of politicians. And so many channels exist now, from social media booming to even traditional media, we all have a voice and we all have one way or another that we can access, or at least that we should be able to access, to raise these kinds of personal issues as political issues. Now sometimes the environment doesn't always allow for that, but hey, for at least my Pacific Island country, heading towards parliamentary democracy, I would hope that my personal issues and those of my peers and those around me would be taken up as political issues because it's about the decisions that those bigger people, quote unquote bigger, make that affect me at a personal level. Back to the jobs. People just don't have jobs. And even those who do, you need to look for additional sources of income because, case in point, the government picks the minimum wage for the day. The government is supposed to make sure that people stick to that minimum wage and that minimum wage should really, really be reflective of the situation of the day. If you have any questions or comments about this issue, whether you have an issue that might be considered personal but is political to you, leave them in the comments or on YouTube or on the Facebook, Family Pacific, or FemVid pages. I've been Sean Rolls. This has been another FemVid in the month of politics. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Dum dum dum, ba da ba da ba da ba 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 da ba, ba da ba da ba 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 da ba, ba da ba da subscribe, subscribe, ba 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 da 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 ba da ba da 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 da. Thank you for watching a fan vid.